Good morning, Morgan. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. I hope you had a good weekend. I hope you're uh, staying safe during all this uh, crazy stuff. Are you, are you staying home a lot? I guess that's what you're supposed to be doing. Kind of. Yeah, I'm staying home. Yeah, kind of. Um, yeah. I've been out and out a little bit, but trying to keep my circle small and everything. It's uh, that's probably wise, wise move. It has been tough. I guess uh, for us, you know, being from a rural area, it is a lot easier for us to social distance than metropolitan yeah. areas. You know, oh, we, yeah. we've been on the water uh, in the boat. Uh, a little bit fishing and hunting and so forth. So I'm glad we have the opportunity to do those things. Hopefully you're doing some of that too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I am. Well, listen, I, I know you, uh, as you might imagine, uh, I'm not calling you out of the blue just to chat. Uh, this is the first annual uh, academic awards banquet that is going to be online and virtual. And um, you've probably figured out by now that I, I've got an award to present to you, especially since as last year, I believe you won female player of the year, of the year last year. Is that correct? That is correct. Well, you are the, uh, the, the first, uh, in recent memory anyway, at least in my memory, the first back-to-back -back winner of the NAI female player of the year for Bethel university, which is not just an athletic award, but is also an academic award. So this goes to somebody that has, uh, has distinguished themselves not only on their uh, in their field of play, uh, in your case on a court, uh, but has also distinguished themselves in the classroom. So this is a uh, this is a big time prestigious award on Bethel University's campus. So um, uh, let me talk a little bit about your uh, about your year, uh, and then we'll get to the presentation here in just a minute. First of all, um, you are a, a senior accounting major from Bradford, Tennessee. Uh, you, at least as when I gathered all my statistics, you were a uh, GPA of 3.87, which is really strong. Um, I don't know if I, man, 3.87 .8, is really good. So uh, that, that's really, really strong in, in accounting, no less. So uh, obviously you've been getting things done in the classroom. Uh, your teachers have spoken highly of you. Your statistics for the year, this is just for the season now. So you averaged uh, uh, 10.3 points a game, uh, 5.7 rebounds per game, uh, and 1.1 assists per game. On, on your career, you have 1,405 points, 781 rebounds, and uh, this year you finished with 264 career three-pointers made, which is a Bethel University record. Nobody has ever hit that many three-pointers in their career ever. Did I get all those right? All those, do you get any? Sounds good to me, yeah. <laughs> uh, you're, you're, uh, you, you did gather some awards this year. Uh, you were first team all-conference in the Southern States Athletic Conference. Um, you were the Southern States Athletic Conference Tournament MVP. Um, you were uh, named to the Women's Basketball Coaches Association All-American team as an honorable mention. Um, and you were an NAIA All-American honorable mention, um, which was released uh, on March 24th. In addition to all that, you also uh, found time somewhere to serve as an accounting intern uh, with the uh, finance department, Dana Corporation, um, where they just raved about you and talked about how great you were. And then I'll tell you what Chris Nelson said, your coach. Uh, this is a quote. Uh, Morgan has been a pillar of our program from the first day she stepped foot on campus. It has been an absolute pleasure to coach, to coach her and watch her play the last four seasons. People like her only come around ever so often. We have been blessed to have her here at Bethel. And I would echo those sentiments. Uh, and I would present you with the NAIA Female Player of the Year Award for Bethel University. So, uh, would you like to have the mic for a minute? Um, thank you. Um, yeah, that is a big um, award, and that's such an honor, too, um, especially back-to-back. -back. So, thank you for that. Absolutely. Would you like to uh, uh, talk a little bit about the season? Uh, obviously, uh, the season would cut short um, with all that was going on. It's crazy, uh, sure. crazy stuff. But, you know, let me ask, what was your fondest memory? Two questions, two part question. Fondest memory of this season, and then I'll ask you fondest memory of your career. And they could be the both both things, things, I guess. Oh my gosh, I could talk all day about this season. Um, fondest memory, I would say, obviously winning the winning the conference championship, which we were regular season, and I think 
just about every – I think every year we've been uh, – I've been at Bethel. We've been regular season champions, but never won a tournament championship. So that was huge this year. But just throughout the year with these girls, I mean, if we ever had a downtime, then we snapped right out of it. And I think Arizona, we went to Phoenix, Arizona, and that was really fun. I didn't play well. I remember I didn't play well, but it was still one of my favorite trips that we've ever been on. So um, altogether, it was just a good season. Um and I would have to say winning conference championship this year was probably my all-time uh, fondest memory of Bethel. Yeah, we were uh, – we actually, me and my family, we had gone to the uh, Bassmasters event where we had a, a Bethel person fishing in the Bassmasters in Birmingham, Alabama. And we were on the way back home listening to Diamond Dave McCulley uh, call yeah. that game. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, we were totally stoked and got to listen to the whole thing and, and hear y'all cutting down the nets and everything. So – I'm glad y'all y'all got to experience that. So just a fantastic memory. Um, again, I, I want to congratulate you and say what a what a fantastic representative you've been for Bethel University. Um, you know, it's it's people like you that that we point to and say, look, this is why uh, Bethel's a special place because you can come to to a place like Bethel and meet people like Morgan Martin and watch her play ball and and you know we're excited and I would speak uh, for all of us here in the athletic department. We're excited to see. Uh, the successes that you're going to have beyond Bethel. Well, so congratulations to you and uh, any parting comments? Um, no, just thank you and thank the whole athletic department and um, just anybody who I've come in contact with at Bethel um, just for always supporting, even whenever things weren't always great, but just for supporting me and uh, Bethel is just like one big family and small community and it, everybody just supports each other and I'm just so blessed to have been a part of that and um, just been supported the way that I was. So thank you and thank everyone else um, who's been a part of my journey at Bethel. Thanks Morgan. Listen, I'll, uh, I'm going to let you go and I, I do want to say uh, be safe and I'll get this into the mail at some point. Uh, okay. I'll drop a, I guess you're local enough. I could conceivably drop, oh, yeah. it, drop it in your mailbox or something, but uh, congratulations again. Thanks for jumping on with me for the first ever Absolutely. virtual academic awards and uh, be safe and, and see you soon. All right. See you. Thank you. Thanks a lot. See you. Bye. Bye.